Hey everyone, I uh, hope you're all doing well. I thought I would do a quick tutorial to sort of show how the setup for night vision and thermal sights work. Because, uh, yeah, when you're at night now in this game, it is uh, properly, properly dark. Um, so the first thing we'll quickly go over is the actual uh, control setup. Uh, so how you have it set up is each to their own, but the things you need to have um, specifically is a hotkey for night vision mode. For me, that's control N, infrared spotlight, control I, and the uh, changing of the color scheme of the thermal sight, um, control T. Now, certain tanks will have night vision only, certain tanks will have night vision and thermals. Um, the night vision will only work at night. You literally, the game literally won't let you switch it on during the day. However, you can still use thermals um, during the day. So at the moment, uh, everything's very dark. Can't see much. The the scope makes it a wee bit clearer. Uh, but if we engage night vision, it uh, it greatly increases your overall visibility. It, it obviously is still very difficult to see things far away. However, um, when you engage night vision, uh, by default it automatically turns on your thermal sight as well. Now thermal vision only works um, with this when you're looking down your gun sight. So if we go control N, there we go. So this is the thermal sight, um, makes things very easy to spot, very easy to shoot. And I miss that obviously, because of course, why not? Um, now there are two different types of thermal sights, so you got this one, um, and then if you hit Control T again, it basically um, toggles the contrast so you can sort of change with how you want it to look. So you got this mode, or you got that mode. Now if you press Control N, it's obviously going to get rid of it. And that's basically it in a in a in a nutshell, really. Um, I guess the only other thing um, is, of course, your engine command. So if you um, switch off your engine, your battery is obviously going to start draining. Um, so once your battery's out, that's going to um, affect performance, like turret performance and so forth. So um, try not to have your engine out too long. And uh, you know it looks very nice with the uh, with the thermal vision. Uh, now what I'll do is I'll just hop into another tank and I'll show you what it looks like uh, with other vehicles as well. So now we're in the um, the German Premium. So you notice this one doesn't have thermal sights, and the night vision doesn't work with the sights. So um, certain tanks, you know, you'll still get night vision, but it only works um, obviously from the the ex the outer perspective. Um, it doesn't have a night vision gun sight, so you still got to rely on the old-fashioned, um, you know, color. But the, uh, the guns look absolutely amazing at night. I gotta admit, like the tracer fire just looks dope. Absolutely cannot complain about it. Um, but I just had some people mention to me that, you know, they couldn't get night vision to work. And um, it, it sounds like that, you know, they were confusing uh, night vision working from the third person view and then not working with the turret with it being broken. But it's actually um, not all guns have the. Um, option to switch to thermal or night vision sights. Um, so hopefully that clears up a few things. Um, if you do have any other questions, please feel free to comment. Um, any and all feedback is appreciated, but that basically wraps up this tutorial. Um, thanks for watching.